Campi Flegre Volcanic Eruption Emergency Response Simulation. The scenario is catastrophic. A volcanic eruption in Campi Flegre, a region near Naples inhabited by hundreds of thousands of people. What to do? The affected area is very large. It includes areas in the red zone of Naples, such as Bagnoli, Foragrata, Socavo, Posilipo, and part of Chiaia, and the municipalities of Bacoli, Monte di Procida, Quarto, Pozzuoli, Giuliano, and Campania Marano. An earthquake swarm began in the Campi Flegre region of southern Italy at 4.33 Coordinated Universal Time, 5.33 Local Time, LT, on Friday, December 6, 2024, and ended at 17.14 Coordinated Universal Time. A new earthquake swarm, lasting about 11 hours, began in the Campi Flegre region of Italy at 4.33 Coordinated Universal Time today. Campi Flegre is a 13 kilometers, 8 miles wide caldera that covers part of Naples and extends south beneath the Gulf of Pozzuoli. The Italian National Institute of Geophysics and Volcanology, INGV, reported a preliminary count of 26 earthquakes, most of them of magnitude M1, and the strongest recorded at M3.4. Light shaking from the M3.4 quake was reported by at least 72 people. While such events are common in seismically active areas, such as Campi Flegre, their shallow nature could lead to an increase in the intensity felt, even at lower magnitudes. The Campanian volcanoes, Vesuvius, Campi Flegre, and Ischia Island, constitute the most monitored and studied volcanic area in the world due to the risk associated with a possible resumption of volcanic activity. Volcanic area is dormant, but is still affected by seismicity, ground deformation, and fumarole activity and is therefore closely monitored, say INGV volcanologists. Campi Flegre has experienced significant cycles of uplift and subsidence since Roman times. The earliest known volcanic products date back to around 47,000 years ago. The caldera was formed after two major explosive eruptions. The Campanian Ignimbrite eruption around 36,000 years ago and the Neapolitan Yellow Tuff NYT eruption around 15,000 years ago, which ejected more than 40 cubic kilometers, 9.6 cubic miles of material. Following the NYT eruption, a number of smaller eruptions occurred from vents scattered both on land and underwater. Most of the activity is concentrated in three periods, 15,000 to 9,500 years ago, 8,600 to 8,200 years ago, and 4,800 to 3,800 years ago. The most recent eruptions were recorded in 1158 AD at Solfatara and in 1538 AD, VEI-3, when the Monte Nuovo ash cone was formed. 